We're presenting a variety of abstracts this, uh, this conference uh, that have to do with improving the quality of care uh, and value for patients with heart disease. Uh, today we're presenting an abstract on uh, the hospital readmission reduction program, which were financial penalties meant to incentivize hospitals to reduce uh, readmission rates after certain disease conditions and what we've demonstrated is that there are concerns that this policy will be harder on hospitals that serve poorer patients. These hospitals may have fewer resources to improve the quality of care. What we've demonstrated is there, there are not very strong relationships between uh, the poverty of a hospital, um, a hospital's patient population and its ability to improve readmission rates except for one specific group. Uh, hospitals that faced high penalties under the hospital readmission reduction program as well as serving low patient populations seem to have been less able to improve their hospital uh, readmission rates. So it raises questions, a lot of important policy questions, about whether a specific group of hospitals, namely those who face high penalties because they have high readmission rates and have populations that are poorer, maybe those hospitals need more help in improving the quality of care. No, that, that's a big criticism of it, and there was actually a debate this morning with Paul Heidenreich and um, Greg Fonerau about the, the utility of the readmission metrics. I, I tend to be a little bit positive about the metrics. I think that uh, the jury's still out about some of this association with uh, the, the law and mortality. I think there's, it seems to be that when you use different statistical methods to analyze the problem, you get different results, so I think it's far from clear what, what, that, what happened. Um, but there's also evidence that the readmission rates came down quite a bit, uh, which probably improved the quality of care for these patients and certainly re reduced costs. Uh, th there's a lot of debate about how much the reductions were, but I don't think uh, anyone in this field uh, doubts that there was a reduction of readmission rates associated with this penalty. And I think that um, it's important to really have an active discussion and debate about this because understanding how health policies and payment systems can be changed in ways that improve the quality of care and value for patients is a critically important question. It's, it, you're, you're never going to be able to uh, fully improve the quality of care as much as we should be able to with current technology if you simply pay doctors and hospitals uh, fees for doing specific procedures and services and visits. It's not uh, a value-oriented system. So we have to understand how to design policies in ways that best do improve quality and value.